we are going to find the equation for the parabola with the x-intercepts positive negative 4 and passing through the point 3, 6. Now whenever we're finding the equation of a parabola we need to uh, figure out and choose which form of the equation we want to use. So we have the standard form for the equation of a parabola and then we have the vertex form and we have the factored form. The standard form, the C value, is the y-intercept for the parabola. In the vertex form, the h, k give you the coordinates of the vertex for the parabola. And in the factored form, the r and the s give you the two zeros of the parabola or the x-intercepts. So for this question, since they are giving us the x-intercepts here, we're going to use the factored form of the equation. So this here means that our uh, roots or zeros for this parabola are 4, 0 and negative 4, 0. So we're going to choose to use the factored form and sub in the values for the two zeros that we're given in the problem. So we're going to go ahead and do that over here. So we're going to start with the general form for the equation of a parabola in factored form. We know that the two zeros are at 4 and negative 4, so we're going to sub in 4 and negative 4 for r and s in this equation. And this is what we get. So x minus 4 and then x minus negative 4 gives us x plus 4, so be careful with your positives and negatives there. Now, we need to find this a value still. The only way to find that a value is to use the extra point we're given here and sub in the x coordinate and the y coordinate for the x and the f at x, and then that's going to leave us with one equation with one unknown value of a, and when we have that, we know that we can isolate a and find the value of a. So here we're going to have a 6 equals a 3 minus 4 and 3 plus 4. So when we evaluate this, 3 minus 4 is negative 1 and 3 plus 4 is 7. So we have negative 7a left on the right hand side. To get a by itself we divide by the coefficient and we get that the a value for this parabola is negative 6 over, over 7 which means that it's a parabola that is open down. So now to finish this off we're going to take that a value that we found here and sub it back in for the a value in the original equation. So the equation for this parabola that we were finding is f at x equals negative 6 over 7, x minus 4, and x plus 4.